Hey Torres, this is Sunny, and this is your weekly for the week of June 29th, 2015. So if you would like a reading from me, the link is in the description. I can't say it right. Description. Description. It's in the description. Bar. Yes. And also after each um, video, I have a picture of where you can get a reading from me from. And also below, I'm going to leave the link to um, my Facebook fan page. If you want to, you can like it. And on there, I sometimes give away um, free readings. And if you have any suggestions or what you would like to see on my Facebook fan page, um, let me know because I really am clueless on what to do about it. So, yeah. But I will say, um, I always lay out six cards um, and also an extra card for the message. But five out of six cards are major cards. So this week is honestly all about change. It's all about you and really what you want. I really do feel like this is a very good week for you guys to just just start over and to just do whatever you want to do. Like, that's good, okay? That's good. But I will say this week is going to be a very popular week for you guys. Um, for you to share your ideas and to share your wisdom. So present yourself nice well professionally and just honestly be you for real a lot of you like you you are going to uh speak out in front of a crowd and you may like meet new people along the way so i feel like a lot of you like you're going to find clarity within these people and this you're going to feel as if these people are connected to you or pretty much on like the same wavelength as you which is very very interesting but a lot of you i do feel like you are like i said you are going to share your wisdom and it's going to give you some sort of clarity and um you guys are going to feel very very good about yourselves so just be cautious of how you communicate and just be genuine like people are going to know if you're not genuine so this is honestly a very good time for you to just be you and to just accept you for the way that you are all right and I feel like others will do the same as well. But just don't pretend to be something that you're not, all right? Oh, my God, my nose itched. So be aware of nosy people. Be aware of people trying to steal your shine, all right? Because I really do feel like the spotlight will be on you guys for this week. It's very interesting. Um, I do feel like there's going to be some sort of sacrifices made towards the relationships that you do have with people. And be aware of the give and take method. Whatever you give to others, um, you know... Hopefully they give it back to you and whatever others give to you, you give it back in return. But if you find that others are being negative and petty towards you, don't give them back that in return. Like just let it go, move it from your life and just cut them off, all right? I do feel like there's going to be some sort of past friends or past lovers come back within your life. Yes, this is a week of the past as well. So um, I feel like it's a head-to-head -head battle between the past and the future which one are you going to pick so i really do feel like if you are ready for the future you are going to have to make some sacrifices involving the past people who, who decide to come back within your life all right because sometimes it's really not worth it to let past people come back within your life um i do feel like there's going to be some sort of fears involving your finances um a lot of you like you need to gain a steady flow involving your finances so i feel like you you need to do some praying towards others you need to be giving in order to give back in return so just help out those who need help and you will get that back three times full so pay attention to that i do feel like it's, this is going to be a very good week for you guys to transform and to metamorphose into something that's very powerful and that's something um very meaningful for you sorry if i seem blah blah blah, blah, blah. i'm very tired all right i'm pulling an all-nighter i really really am um but honestly this is a very good time for you to just close the door that needs to be closed and open doors that are ready to be opened all right just stop focusing on the past stop staying at the past just be ready for change because the universe is like you are taking too long to accept change so i'm going to accept change for you whether you like it or not so just be like okay all right universe i I appreciate it let me be open to it because if you're not ready then you're just going to be unprepared so just be prepared for this all right i'm warning you now <laughs> so um this also be a very good week for you guys to forgive yourself and to forgive others and to just close like i said close the door if you are tied into 
I'm a Scorpio. I do feel like the relationship between you and the Scorpio, there will be either forgiving or disclosure or finding an understanding on what happened within the relationship. Like there's some sort of final ending to things. So say what you got to say and honestly just move on from it. Just do what you need to do. Um, if you guys are going through depression, just know that brighter days are heading your way. Just be just accepting to change and just don't let the past come back within your life. But the message of the week for you guys, mm, trust your intuition. The universe is really like, trust your intuition and trust me, all right? Women, especially, your intuition is going to be very, 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 very strong for this week. And just pay attention and treat your womanly goodness good, all right? So if you can, get checked up. Um, and just, just know that, like, if you are in a relationship or... Or if you notice people just want to fuck you, like, you can always say no. You don't have to say yeah to people who just want to have sex with you. Like, you know, like, you are worth more than sex, alrighty? So, you have a good week this week, my Taurus, and I'll see you guys next week. Bye.